Ugh, my stuff is so boring. A plain silver MacBook, boring iPhone cases, and iPhone charger. And this speaker is just blah. Let's add some magic to these plain electronics. Ah, <sighs> much better. Hey Glitter Critters, it's Breland here, and in this video today, I'm gonna basically be showing you how to holograph your entire life. So I'm gonna be showing you how to add a beautiful and sparkly holographic design to some of your tech items as well as some little holographic decorations that you could put in your room. Make sure you hit that subscribe button right below this video to become an official glitter critter. We're actually trying to reach an all new goal of 1,500,000 glitter critters and it would be epic if you joined our Glitterful world. So this is also a collaboration with my friend Haley Williams. She created a super Super awesome iPhone case video for you guys which I'll be sure to link at the top of the description below make sure you go and you check it out and don't forget to subscribe to her channel so without further ado let's go ahead and let's get started Looking at it now. so the first holographic DIY it's not a tech item but I saw this cup sitting on my table and thought it would be so cute just to set on your desk or nightstand as a holographic decoration for your room so I got this clear Starbucks cup with a regular lid and I'm using this holographic origami foil that I got on Amazon links will be below and I put it into the cup and marked where it needed to be cut and did all my fancy schmancy measuring and clipping and then I just taped it to the inside of the cup I also had to cut some of the paper into strips so it would bend a little better and I stuffed some tissue inside of the cup to make the holographic paper flatten out a little bit more and that puts the whipped cream on the pumpkin spice latte Okay, so have you ever looked down at your iPhone charger and been like, baby, you need a makeover? Well, you know what? I'm going to help you with that today. So I got this duck prism duct tape off Amazon. I will link it below. And I started out with the plug portion of my iPhone charger. I just measured and I cut out the duct tape to fit it. And then I just wrapped it around the charger. I mean, there's really not much to this. It's pretty much self-explanatory. And I also wanted to give it some extra sugar and spice by wrapping some tape around the other portions of the charger as well because normally I just see it around the plug portion so that is all for this little DIY Ooh, shh don't tell anyone but this really isn't a Bluetooth speaker it's just pretend Bluetooth speaker so if you have a Bluetooth speaker that you bought really cheap and it's not really that cute basically me my life hashtag my life I'm gonna show you how to decorate it so I got some of this self-adhesive holographic paper off Amazon also linked below and I pretty much just measured and cut it to fit this little speaker here and yeah like I said before this is a really really old prehistoric speaker that I got out of David's man cave he doesn't know and I just decorated it for him so now I'm just gonna put it back and just see what he says so if you're as tumbler as I am you already know girl these holographic iPhone cases are just so glitter fantastic like I don't even have a word for them I love them so to make these oh my gosh it's so simple I'm just using the same holographic paper that I used in the previous DIY and I put my iPhone 6 plus case on it I traced it and just cut it out so basically I was just using it for the design I'm not gonna actually use it for what it's intended for which is to like stick on to things so next I just cut out the camera part with an exacto knife and I just taped it in there so it wouldn't fall out and fly away that would be bad okay so for this next one oh my gosh look at this case y'all I mean this case is like so cute it's got this ombre effect and then it's got these little raindrop beads it reminds me of a rainforest like a beautiful heavenly rainforest and I use some of the same origami foil iridescent holographic paper I cut it to fit and I cut out the camera hole with an exacto knife and then I taped it in as well and look at this gorgeous design it gives off <sighs> I feel so magical now these holographic laptop stickers are gonna make your friends be like, what? You made that? How? Well, you know what? I'm gonna tell you. Using the same self-adhesive holographic paper. Yeah, I know I've used this way too many times in this video, but you know what? That just means I'm a multi-purposer. 
if that's even a word, probably not. So I printed out these black lined images onto this paper, and FYI, do not print out color on this type of paper. It don't work out very good, okay? And also, this takes a while to dry. I guess because the black ink kind of sits on top of this paper, and it took overnight for these to dry for me. So I also printed out some of these fake holographic looking pattern stickers, like the CD and the heart, and then I just went crazy. I was like, oh my gosh, no, I want a donut. I want SpongeBob. I want an elephant, a watermelon. Like, I want everything. Hello, I'm a mermaid. So I just used double-sided tape to stick on the other stickers, which I printed out on cardstock. And last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to become an official glitter critter so we can reach our new goal of 1,500,000 glitter critters. Also, go check out Haley's video. It's linked in the description below. I thank you so much for watching, and have a glitterful day. Bye! I love you!